Alright, and welcome back. We're about to take on uh, Erica here with my shiny new Vile Plume. I also have another shiny Pokemon. So I went to Celadon. Why do I keep doing that? I went to Celadon's uh, department store. I got a Leaf Stone and a Water Stone, so they pour on a Vile Plume. I've been born onto this playthrough. Also, taught to Pokemon some a few new TMs, so we should be good. We're just gonna straight up take on Erica here because. Honestly, this should be easy. This should be easy. If I have any difficulties, I need to reevaluate my life. Let's just get this done. I honestly could just leave Charizard to his machinations, but we gotta train up other Pokemon. But I do not plan on healing up because Charizard could just solo should be able to solo. My overconfidence is going to be my downfall one of these days. about to have some problems with the poison there, but Pidgeotto pulled through. That's what Wing Attack does. Although using it on a weak Pokemon doesn't really tell me anything, but... Gonna let Charizard and Pidgeotto tag team. I'll let Pidgeotto handle all this for the extra experience. Who is next? Grass types are not easy to, learn, to, to train. They only learn like a handful of moves of all the same type. It's a shame that there's no chance that Pidgeotto will get the evolution out of this. fellow beginning trainer person since he can't find you know the star Pokemon out in the wild for some reason I wonder if we're ever gonna have a region where we can catch any set of starter Pokemon Maybe it's a giant conspiracy. Maybe it was like an island 
has a forcing like a forceful breeding program for all these starters that the professors fly to to gather them. The only reason why they're rare is because they made them rare. Alright, here's another theory. What if starter Pokemon are genetically like man-made Pokemon? Using the best attributes of the region's Pokemon. That one has zero weight to it. But it is strange the amount of people living in Kanto. Unless giving out Charmander Bulls on Squirtle are relatively nil. You would think that a lot more people would have those Pokemon. <laughs> Where is it that only people from Palatown get them? Attack is getting pretty light. Oh, that's not good. Well, we do have a paralyzed heal actually. to switch in there. I might heal up because I want Kujio to be nice and healthy for Erica's Pokemon. Goodness, we really get, so, get such good momentum coming into this. I'm just going to take out these last two trainers and then we're going to heal up. Effective against poison types. I get that's a grass gym, but still. Nobody here has had a pure grass type Pokemon yet. Alright, enough jibber jabber. Let's go heal up and finally take out Erica. Alright, moment of truth. Let's do this. Not what they all say. And they eventually lose.
Oh, did she even send out a Pokemon? Man. I'm gonna just have Charizard solo this. Charizard hasn't had his chance to spread his wings in a while. why Charizard's the starter. Boom. Quickest gym battle I've had <laughs> so far. Giga Drain? Alright, we're gonna end the episode here. See you guys in the next one. Peace.